Welcome everybody. This is Cindy Nicholson from Braintree. I'm joined here with Michael Goh, the Sydney Stock Exchange CEO. We're here to celebrate International Women's Day today. We're going to have a room full of people and an amazing panel, and we're here to talk about gender equality for a sustainable future. Michael. Yeah, welcome everyone. It's a great day, the Sydney Stock Exchange in partnership with Braintree and the UN International Women's Day Committee are proud to, to host this day. You know, we do believe that um, supporting the SMEs and high growth companies is important. We do this, we think, by supporting gender diversity, which helps with profitability and risk management. So, you know, with that, we open the event and we hope you have a great day. My name is Kylie Porter and I am the Executive Director of the UN Global Compact Network Australia, the Australian local network of the UN Global Compact, which is the world's largest corporate sustainability initiative. Gender equality is important to us because it is one of the 17 Sustainable Development Goals, or SDGs, which are core to the UN Sustainable Development Agenda for 2030. And not only that, gender equality and empowering women and girls is good for business. At the UN Global Compact Network Australia, we connect, enable and lead Australian businesses to create a sustainable future by acting responsibly and finding opportunities to impact our world for good. Our partnership with the Sustainable Stock Exchange Initiative is part of our ongoing commitment to support the private sector in their efforts to achieve the SDGs by 2030 particularly goal five, to achieve gender equality and empower women and girls. With just eight years left to achieve the Sustainable Development Agenda, businesses globally are integrating the SDGs and key principles of responsible business into their strategies and operations, including SDG five. This is our decade to deliver. Today's Ring the Bell initiative is a fantastic opportunity to connect one and all with most of the pressing, pressing issues of our time, gender equality. I wish you all an enjoyable event and a thought-provoking conversation. We look forward to speaking to you all soon. Thank you. I'm Katie McGrath, Chief People and Culture Officer at Seven West Media. Gender equality matters because it's a basic human right. At the current rate, it'll take Australia 135 years to achieve gender equality. That is not acceptable.
Hi, my name is Noga Edelstein and I'm entrepreneur in residence at Tractor Ventures. We provide revenue-based financing alternatives for founders. Less than 3% of venture funding globally goes to women-led startups. And one of the main challenges is access to capital. I believe we need more women making investment decisions. At Tractor Ventures, we have a majority of our co-founders are female and it flows through because a third of the companies we have funded also have a woman in the founding team. If I can have an ask of you today, please ask your daughters, granddaughters, encourage them to study STEM and consider entrepreneurship as a career path because there's no greater way to gender equality than having more women be their own boss. Thank you. Hi, my name is Jen Rummel from Quit News and the International Campaign to Abolish Nuclear Weapons Australia. Our goal is to end nuclear weapons and we see this as critical for gender equality. Nuclear weapons disproportionately impact women and girls and the threat of nuclear war undermines everyone's work for gender equality and a better world. To address this issue, we're working with Australian financial institutions, in particular super funds, to end investments in nuclear weapons producing companies. Nuclear weapons are now illegal under international law and they have no legitimate role in our world. We know that withdrawing finance from nuclear weapons producers is a meaningful contribution to achieving nuclear disarmament and peace. Thank you. Hello, I'm Shiri Chen, the General Manager of AHP Glue. I'm lucky in a relatively gender equal society that gives me the opportunity to achieve what I want to be, rather than having it determined by my gender. Our company also embraces diversity and the values important role of women in the workplace and in life. I hope all of us could be what we want to be, rather than what society assigns women to be. Thank you. Hello, happy International Women's Day to everybody. I'm Michelle Jenner from On Purpose Transformation and congratulations, what a fabulous way to be celebrating International Women's Day by talking about breaking the bias. The bias that each and every one of us has and that we need to work on each and every day, not just International Women's Day, so that everybody, regardless of race, creed, colour, situation and circumstance, can have the opportunity to shine and be the, all that they can be in their lives. So congratulations to my fellow women leaders. We are breaking the bias.